Hi, welcome to my new channel. In this video, I'm going to give a brief overview on how I use my iPad Pro within my workflow as a structural engineer. I just upgraded my iPad Pro from a 2017 model, so I'm now using the second gen pencil, which has a much better grip and feel and a way better method of charging. So the main reason I bought my first iPad Pro was because I had an aim to go paperless. As part of my job, we do a lot of printing drawings, handwriting calculations, and going to meetings where you would need to take a lot of notes. It was a lot to carry when you were out of the office, but using the iPad Pro really changed that. As I've been showing using GoodNotes, I can import my company's calculation template and write my calculations as if on normal calculation pads. The two main benefits are if you make a mistake, you can easily go over and correct yourself without using a rubber or tip -X. Secondly, it completely omits the need to scan calculations. To prepare your calculation for building control submission, you would generally need to scan in all your calculations and compile them on the computer. Scans always lose resolution and clarity, so being able to export to PDF is clean, simple and fast. We have to do a lot of drawing reviews, and that used to involve printing sets of drawings, marking them up, scanning them and passing them over to a draftsman to revise. In GoodNotes, it is dead easy to import a load of PDFs and go to town with marking them up. Once you're done, it's just a case of exporting them back to PDF and sending them to the right person. I've tried and used other note-taking apps, such as Notability and PDF Expert. However, I have found GoodNotes has suited my needs the best and has given me the best writing experiences, as well as importing and exporting to PDF. Sketching and drawing is probably the main reason I got the iPad Pro in pencil. We do a lot of concept sketching and detailing and it is a really important skill to have. Being able to demonstrate ideas through quick and simple sketches is very powerful as often contractors do build from sketches. I use concepts which is an app more suited for architects or, art or artists or people who can draw properly. I definitely do not use the app to its full capabilities mainly because my drawings are pretty limited. What makes concepts so useful for me is that you can export to PDF in really high quality. The toolset is really simple to use and set up to how I like it, and it can make simple sketches look really good. You can make sketches as detailed as you want. The amount of time and effort I put into a sketch depends on who I'll be sending it to. To clients and architects, I'll tend to put more time into making it look fancier with some colour. If it is for internal use, I would generally not put as much effort into making it look super pretty. I hope you enjoyed this short video. I will be producing more videos on how I use these apps in detail. If you have any questions relating to these apps or any engineering questions, please drop me a comment.